Hello everyone. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to solve the issue of a PC getting stuck on the shutting down or restarting screen. As you can see, I've been trying to shut down my PC, but it's taking forever and not shutting down. I've had to use the button on the cabinet to force shut down, but that's not the right way to do it. The same problem happens when I try to restart, it gets stuck in a loop. So, let's solve this problem together. First of all, power off your PC completely. Open your PC side panel. The first thing we need to check is the BIOS settings. Sometimes, a messed up BIOS setting can cause this issue. To reset the BIOS, we need to remove the CMOS battery. Remove the CMOS battery and leave it out for about 5 minutes. While the CMOS battery is out, also remove the RAM. After 5 minutes, reinsert the CMOS battery and RAM. The next step is crucial. Sometimes, a bad hard drive can cause this problem. If your PC has multiple hard drives, one of them could be the culprit. Remove all hard drives except the one where your Windows is installed. In my case, I have three old hard drives and one SSD where Windows is installed. I'll remove the three hard drives and leave only the SSD connected. If the problem persists, try powering on your PC without the CMOS battery. So, let's power on the computer now. We've successfully powered on, but we need to test if it's working properly. Let's shut down the PC and see if it gets stuck. The PC is now shutting down without any issues. It's not getting stuck anymore. Don't forget to put the CMOS battery back in. This is crucial. Now, let's power the PC back on and test if everything is working fine. That's it guys. The PC is working without any problems now. Thank you for watching this video. If you found this helpful, please like, comment, and subscribe for more tech solutions. See you in the next video.